In cadence, Rick. One, two, three, four. In cadence. One, two, three, four. A little more exaggeration, Rick, of just, don't just poke it. All right, let me use your horse a bit, Rick, because that's a great, I remember this horse, and I remember that this will be a perfect example for the team here, okay? And for you. All right, this is a big old, great quarter horse. These horses sometimes, you know, if you've got a horse that's left brain, uh, especially some of the left brain introverts, they'll just get kind of lazy. You know, you've heard about dull horses on. My horse is sort of brain dead. I kick it, I poke it, I slap it, it's mean, it's asleep, right? Well, we can change that with a little sensitization, but really what we need to do is establish good technique and remind it. So we're gonna bend this horse and we're gonna do one, two, three, four, but if I don't get the sense that he's paying attention to me, he's not really, sh then I can accelerate that with a little snap. I'm not gonna keep touching him, believe me. You talk about desensitizing the horse to this and really doling them, is you just keep pounding on him, okay? And he's going, well, hell, it doesn't matter what I do, he's just gonna keep poking. That's the way you make the horse really neurotic or brain dead, you just sit there going, eh. This is like torture. But knowing when to accelerate those cues, keeping in cadence, keeping in rhythm. One, two, 